Right, so hi guys, Matt here with Drug Tech and I hope everyone is doing fine. Just a couple of moments ago, a package came in and it's from the company called ESR. If you're the type of person who watches uh, case videos on YouTube, you have known this brand called ESR. They make pretty good cases, not to say the best quality like Autobox and LifeProof and those kind of brands, but it's very worth it at the price that they sell their cases and also screen protectors. I mean, I haven't tried the screen protectors. So don't take my word on that, but their cases, I can say they are pretty good. In fact, they are much cheaper than brands like Spigen, considering that I have a product which Spigen is also offering. Uh, slightly different, of course, the cutting, but it is basically the same thing. Alright, so just a little update on my previous uh, Autobox and Live Proof videos. I actually have a discount link where you can actually click on the link and get a voucher. So you can actually save some money and also helps out the channel because I do get a small commission from every purchase so it'll be great because both sides win both the buyer as well as me so i hope you guys will take the time to actually click the link and browse through their lazada page of course it's only for malaysians i'm sorry for international buyers i have no connection with autobox global so i only have autobox malaysia all right so let's get right into this package right here i have a couple of items so i'll be doing them one by one so the rest will come in the future videos so let's uh, open this package so that's all in this uh, nice envelope here. Okay, so right here, I have a couple of cases and also a free gift, which is must. Technically, this is a pretty good free gift. I mean, considering the time that I'm making this video during the COVID-19 outbreak. All right, so let's put that to the side. All right, so I have a few cases here. The first case, which I'm going to be doing is for the AirPods Pro. The second will be probably for the iPhone 11 Pro Max and the third for the Huawei P30 Pro. I mean the Huawei P30 Pro is probably not relevant in 2020 because they have the P40 Pro already. But anyways, I'll be still doing a case. So I actually use a Rhino Shield solid suit at the moment. But I think this case, the buttons are not really up to standard. So I actually bought another case. All right, let's take these two cases out of the way. Let's focus on the AirPods Pro case. I'm sure many of you have AirPods Pro at the moment. So this will be probably a very interesting video for you guys right now i'm actually using a case with my airpods pro and this is a case of unique this is a clear case i'm still testing it out to see whether there's there are any yellowing issues but for now as you can see no yellowing issues right here and i'm also using the same case with my iphone 11 pro max all right so let's get into the unboxing of the esr sort of fake leather case i don't want to spend too much on cases like nomad because they actually provide basically the same amount of drop protection just except that those cases are more premium because they are real leather but i mean this is usually in my pocket most of the time the case and i usually take out just my airpods pro i mean so i don't really need a very flashy case so i decided to get one of these both of these cases in fact this unique one as well is uh, pretty cheap if i'm not mistaken this is uh below 80 ringgit all right so let's focus on this case let's open the box right here so you can see esr protective airpods pro cover which is basically airpods pro case so you can see the features complete protection reliable and easy access for charging i mean basically that's for almost all airpods pro case okay so guys so one thing i want to highlight about this unique case that i'm using currently i'm testing uh is that this front lid doesn't open fully i'm not sure why you can see it's open at slight angle down as compared to without the top portion let me take this out and show you so you can see the original case actually opens up at a wider angle so it makes it much easier to take out the airpods pro but with this top piece mm, not so much in fact i have my nail scrapping on the top of the lid every time i take out my airpods pro so i don't really like that i hope this case doesn't have the same issue okay so let me take out this uh, unique case right here so the airpods pro is now out of the case all right so i just uh pull open the sticker so this shows that the case is actually new it's like a seal let's see what do we get in the package right so inside the box we actually get the case itself do we have anything else nope we don't have we just get this case right here let me take it out of the plastic packaging and also there's a foam inside and also a metal ring in the picture this ring is actually circle i'm not sure why it's over here but anyway i won't be using this because i rather use a lanyard or something so let's take a look at this case let's measure the dimensions 
But instead of my measuring calipers here, alright, let's take a look at the measurement. So let me turn it on. So you can see the thickness of the case is actually very slim. And a 1.5 millimeters, which is pretty good. I mean, you want to keep your airport slim so you can actually put it in your pocket. That means that you won't be getting that much drop protection as well. It's mostly uh, maybe knock and scratch protection. That's about it. Let's take a look at this uh, top portion of the case. You can see that's a sticky adhesive right here, which I bet I'm supposed to peel out. Yes, I'm supposed to peel that off. So when you stick this on, it will not actually come flying out. And also on the bottom portion, you can see the ESR branding right here. You can see there's a look for the strap or for this uh, metal ring right here. On the back, let's see, do we have anything to press the button with? In fact, there's actually a small material portion right here at the back. I'm not sure whether that helps pressing the button. I'll try that later. And there's also a hole in front for the charging status light so let's uh, try to fit in the airpods pro into this case so sliding the bottom first very snug fit i like it so you can see in the back portion there's a cutout for the hinge right here let's take a look at the top portion slide it on of course i'm not going to remove the adhesive yet until i've cleaned my airpods case you can see this cutout is slightly bigger than the one from unique i'm pretty sure this would actually open full Let's try it. Yes, it does. So this case actually a go in my opinion because this is the main portion which are going to be interacting daily as you take out the AirPods Pro. So you have to open this in order to take out the AirPods Pro. So if this hinge doesn't open fully, you're going to have a hard time trying to slide out the AirPods Pro. And this case solves the issue. So in my opinion, a unique case fails in that department. So this ESR case actually feels really good. I should say it feels really, really premium. I like the feel in the hand. And also you can see at the bottom, the charging port is lined up perfectly in the center. So you're not going to have a problem with uh, plugging in and charging your case. Alright, so let's take a look at the button and see whether it does uh, have any function right here, even though there's no cutout. So let me press it. Uh, fortunately. Oh, it does work actually. But you have to press pretty hard because there's actually no cutout at the back. So I think that that is something where they have to look into in the design department. But other than that, this case is really good. This has been a very quick look at the ESR file leather case for the AirPods Pro. It looks classy and it's uh, pretty cheap as well. I think it goes for around 25 ringgit. So it's a really, really good deal. I would suggest you getting this if you're looking for a nice premium looking case for your AirPods Pro. All right, so that wraps up this video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to this channel for more content just like this. And I'll see you guys in the next video.